Hello everybody, welcome to the official Bodno channel. My name is Shlomo Meisels. And I'm Benji Brawl, and today we're gonna show you how to unbox and install your Badgie 100. Inside your Badgie 100 box, you'll find the Bodno software. Next, we have a 50 print starter ribbon. This is effectively your ink cartridge for your printer. Next, we have your power source, which includes the cable and the box. We also have a gray wire that connects the Badgie 100 to your computer. It also includes the print driver and 50 blank PVC cards. Last but not least, we have the Badgie 100 printer, which, although similar, is different from the Badgie 200. The Badgie 100 will not print to the edge of the ID, while the Badgie 200 does, so be aware of this difference. This package comes in two options, with or without a camera. In order to install the ribbon, you look at where it says this side up. If those words are right side up, it's faced correctly. You then put the side with more ribbon facing the front of the printer, which in this video is facing you. We're now going to place the blank ID cards into the printer. You can use the standard cards that come with the Badgie 100, but I personally will be using the Bodno cards. You now take these cards and make sure that you hold them by the sides. Avoid touching the face of the cards as dirt, oil, and lint from your fingers can ruin the prints. You then close the lid and that's it until we attach the wires. We're now going to attach our power source. Make sure to plug it into a wall and not a power strip. We're now going to install the print driver. If you have a CD port on the computer you wish to use, you may use the CD that comes with the Badgie 100. If you do not, we'll show you how to download it now. Now we are going to install your driver. First, you're going to want to open up your search engine and go to Badgie's official site, Badgie.com. Once you're on Badgie's official site, you're going to want to go down to Drivers and Firmware. Here you'll see two links for both Windows and for the Mac. We're going to include both links in the description down below. However, sometimes the links change when Badgie updates its driver. So if the link doesn't work, go on to Badgie.co and press on the link that applies to you whether you have a Windows computer or a Mac. In our case, we have a Windows computer, so we're going to click the Windows link. Now in the bottom left, you will see Setup Badgie and you will click on that. At this point, your computer will ask you if you'd like to allow Badgie to make changes to your device. You will click Yes. Then Badgie will ask you what language you'd like to continue in. In our case, we will choose English and click OK. Then Badgie will have a welcome page open up, where you will then click Next. Then there will be the Badgie Warranty Agreement. You will read the agreement, click on I understand and accept the warranty agreement terms, and click Next. Then there will be some information about the Badgie 100. You will read it and click Next. Next, you will decide which folder Badgie will be installed into. You can choose your own or you can choose the one that's provided. Then you will click Next. Next, you can choose which components you'd like to install and then click Next. Next, Badgie will ask you if you'd like to create a folder in the startup menu. Once you've decided, you click Next. Next, you can select additional tasks. When you are finished, click Next. Now you are ready to install, so click Install. At this point, you plug your printer into your computer as shown here. We're now going to attach our Badgie 100 to our computer the using the gray setup. wire Once with you are the ready, USB port. Badgie on it. will automatically open Make up sure you do this you after installing the, the print driver computer, and not before. Be more options to continue. All right, we are now going to install the Bodno software using the USB license key provided, or you can use the link to the latest version for both the Windows and the Mac, which can be found in the description box down below. It is important that the USB license is plugged in before you start the Bodno design software. Otherwise, it will run in demo mode and will print with a watermark. Once you've plugged in your Bodno USB, Bodno will open up to a welcome page. Here, you will be able to select which language you'd wish to continue in. In our case, we will choose English and click Next. Then, 
Bono will give you the option to install either in the Programs folder or in a different folder of your choice. We will choose the Programs folder and click Next. Then, Bono will give you the option to create shortcuts to make it more easily accessible to access their software in the future. You've now completed the Bono installation, so click Finish. You will then read the license agreement, click I accept the terms of the license agreement, and click OK. Then, within a few seconds, Bono will automatically open up where you will be able to register and start creating your ID cards. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed. If this video has been helpful, leave a like and subscribe for more ID card printing content. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, comment in the comment section down below. And, and welcome, welcome to the Bono family. family.